So today I have a 12 pound jackfruit. And so this one was $1.69 a pound. It came out to $20. And um, normally what we would look for or what we did look for before and got a super good ripe one, it was green on the outside. It had some brown spots on it like this one did, like the speckles on each little um, raised part here. And also if you smell it, you should be able to smell like a faint scent of jackfruit. And also it's just a teeny bit squishy. So hopefully this one is ripe. I don't know, I guess we'll have to see. So I will show you guys how I open this jackfruit and we'll do a taste test. So I just put some gloves on because jackfruit naturally has this kind of like latexy sap on the inside of the kind of like stem that runs through the middle and um, it's white and it's very, very, very sticky. So I'm gonna put a little bit of coconut oil on my knife and away we go. Let's see. I'm gonna just cut it right in half. <laughs> I'm not strong enough. <laughs> this smells so good. Oh my god. So now I'm gonna cut it into quarters. And then I'm gonna cut the stem part out. Because that is the part that is sappy, mostly. And then I'm gonna use this plastic bag and all of the latexy stuff, you pat it, it will stick to the bag. Anyways, with these ones, you would just go like this, and all the little pods kind of like pop out. And then you just separate the pods from the little, um, stringy things on the inside, and then just cut them off. There we go, our first piece. And just peel off those little outer things on the outside, those little stringy things. So this is the jackfruit. These are the pods of fruit, and looks like that. And you just wanna peel off these little stringy things. In every pod of fruit, there is a seed. You can boil them and then peel the skin off the seed and you can eat them. Okay, we're nearly there. If you've never had jackfruit before, it has this kind of like smell that's like, a lot of people describe it as like bubblegum or like juicy fruit bubblegum and the flavor as well. And I can see how, I can see how that would be because it does have this like tropical bubblegum type smell and flavor. It's just so unique. There we go, that was the last piece, yay! Okay, so now that the jackfruit has been taken out of its shell, this is how much fruit we ended up from the 12 pound jackfruit. So there's quite a bit and it smells incredible. So, I'm very excited to taste this. I think Daisy is very excited too. Which one should we eat? This one? Ready? Go. Oh! Mmm! Oh my gosh! It is so good. It's definitely crunchier 
than the really, really ripe orange one that I had in California, but it's still like really flavorful. I just love tropical fruit. It gives me life in a way that apples can't. <laughs> it's just so good and satisfying and mm. I feel like I need to move to somewhere tropical where I can eat these kind of amazing fruits every day because if I could, I totally would. <laughs> William! Can you get looking? What's cooking? I'm not cooking anything. Oh, yeah. Mm, it's crunchy. It's not soft like the other one. Is it good? It's still like flavorful, so it's okay. It's yellow jackfruit. It's definitely yellow. What happened to calm and collected William? I think it's because I think it's because I, I took after you a little bit. You're so cute. No, you are. <laughs> You're gonna be in my jackfruit video. What do you mean? I'm filming you right now this entire time. Are you really? Yes. <laughs> Yeah. Where? There's no turning back. Bring it. <laughs>